Captain's Log, start date January 17th, 2010. I am here at this point recording this video to make it perfectly clear, although it was a bit of a mistake for that last video I made, but you know what? Regardless of that video, I, did, I shouldn't have not have had to make such a video because I could, prove, I could just show you all the evidence that I have just read through the entire bunch of pages of, of Alex Asper Chew. Unedited, all fresh from the website, organized by page number, in my playlist. First off, just to name a few things, there's an, there are the obvious Dirty slanders and obvious references to which I mean the old Buddha belly that I used to have, exaggerated man boobs, and even the goatee I used to have. I had one time, and he makes him, and he makes his Aspergy character wear nearly every shirt I wear, nearly every shirt, and a crappy copy of a medal my shirts. And then to make matters worse, he goes and besmirches my old my dog by making a crap by making a crappy flat crappy copy of my dog. My Patty will have Patty's, the spirit of Patty will have his soul for dinner tonight. She will be haunting your nightmares, Mr Leary. And of course, even including the unapproved recreation of my character, of my person, within his pages, as you can see right here, you can find all these on his Asperpedia. That was uh, issue C, page 19, by the way. And then, even worse, starting on page. C-29, he sets me on fire. He sets me on fire. And an even worse could he let me be on fire on page 30. I swear, if that ain't the most outrageous thing that he has ever done against me. But I could, de I could definitely reference a few more instances of where he actually is considered peeing on himself within his own comic series. Starting with, of course, with a few from his first book of graphic nudity or sexual reference on page three of his zero book. Even worse off, on page ten, and while he's in that Burger King, with all his goddamn homosexual references as well. And he's got like a whole number of them I could read you a list off of. You can find these in, find such nude images on page on zero book zero pages three ten thirteen fourteen eighteen and book A twelve thirteen eighteen nineteen twenty three twenty nine book B one four five six seven eight eleven twelve thirteen fifteen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty two twenty four and book C page two. I put in so many. But like I said, putting home, so many homosexual references between books 0, B, and 1. And he uses uncensored swear words such as shit and ass in between all, in between all of his books. So many goddamn of those. And his, and his A and B books are anti-religious. Anti-religious in those two books. That little son of a bitch, he's pe basically peeing on his own self. Now look, I'll admit I have done my little share of nudity within the comp within my few page, within a couple of pages, but they were censored by either images of lemon for vagina and bananas for dick. And it was, and the 
and, the, and that book was finally finalized and organized so that it'd be appropriate for all for all those of ages TVY7 and such. And I and if I ever said a swear word within my book, I would censor it. But he does not censor his own swear words. But like I said, he's basically gone to the things again. He's basically mocking me with the references of myself. Between my between the between the belly, the man boobs, the goatee, the glasses, numerous shirts, a fake medal, where I yeah. A, a copy of my dog, an unapproved recreation of myself and my son and my characters, and even sets me on fire, and makes my and makes what is, it makes his it makes his quote unquote sonnet shoe cologne go against me as being as not being the original creator of the original sonnet shoe. Now, the original sonnet shoe. Of that thing can be caught in the wild. So therefore, as far as, far as I'm concerned, that's just another, that's just another one he caught from the wild and drew as his own a clone, basically. Just another individual, aside from aside from the original science sheet that only lives in Quickville, and also in reference to the unapproved use within book number zero on pages 19 to 24, including including the homosexual references. He supposedly thinks that there's a that he supposedly thinks that there's this law change in Quickville, and it is wrong for him to quote Quickville at all within his book, and no such changes as he has said has happened within Quickville. He wishes he knows my Sanchi Rose shoe and all my electric hedgehogs as well as I do, but he cannot because he is not me, the original creator. He is not me. So, I'd send this message again to Alec, Evan, and even Mal. I have less offense with Sean, by the way. But to those three, <coughs> die. Die in hell. And I hope the soul of my late dog eats at your souls and kills you in your sleep. But aside from that, his book, his book is the pages within the so-called Aspertu series. They are definitely ludicrous and horrendous and horrific. Even a horrific, even as horrific as within Vivian G's own book. And my pastor Elizabeth Foss, my pastor has read the book from cover to cover, and she hates it. My reverend hates it. And I don't like it either because it is of disgrace and slander and mockery of my person and my character. Just as by as much, but actually this is worse. The Aspergue and everything there, that is worse than that book. I'm sorry, Vivian, but that book is just no good. And I'm definitely going let my, to let my pastor know about the Asperpedia and the Aspertu and through all the power, through her powers within her church and the congregation and even the FBI, we will see you in Minnesota and take you down personally, Mr. Alec Basin Larry. We get the FBI on our side. Your mockery of my person is not appreciated. Other than that, I'll leave with most everybody else in peace. Have a good day. Except for you three of which I mentioned earlier. <laughs>